And hello, all you archaeologists. I'm the John Strutt. And I'm about to begin. And I'm about to begin. An Iudan Chronicle Rising Adventure. Right, uh. So, a couple of years ago, there was this Kickstarter, and it was like, uh, the people that made Suikoden. And I was like, ah, oh, my brother's having a birthday. I'll, um, for his birthday, I, 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 there might have been a pandemic going on. Uh, I'll, 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 I'll do the Kickstarter for him. Which I've still got, of course the game's not out yet, because this isn't that game. Uh, this is like a pre-version of that game? Like a version, like a prequel, but it's first, so it's not a prequel, it's just, but it's like a pre but you know what I mean. A game before the game. It's the right, you know. Anyway. This is on Xbox. It's on the old Xbox Game Pass. And I, I still have an account on that, so I figured I should play it. Since I'm told it's quite short as well. The other thing is, since buying my brother uh, the um, Kickstarter, I don't. he's a little busier than I am, so I might be claiming it from him. But also, I played on stream Suikoden. I don't know how you pronounce that word either. Uh, or Ayoden. Uh, maybe they'll say it. Maybe they'll say it out loud, and then I could be like, "That's how you say it." Anyway, so like now, I, I've recently played that game. I can compare the two, but this isn't the game I'd be comparing it to. I think. But you know, we're gonna post a new game. I did test it out to see if it worked. Yes. Very briefly. It looks very nice. Hmm, been walking for a while now. It's CJ, a young girl descended from generations of scavengers. She's come to New Neva, which is heaven and backwards, as we all know, uh, to complete her family's rite of passage. Rune barrows discovered, says on the flyer. Wealth beyond your wildest dreams await you in New Nieva. Doesn't really roll off the tongue, New Nieva, does it? All adventurers welcome. What happened to the old Nieva? How do, how, do, how do you pronounce that word? Based on what I heard at the inn yesterday, shouldn't be too far now. Unless I'm lost. Ah, stop, says a lizard man with a hat on. Now, I understand there were at least five Suikodens, and they got 3D. Uh, you, help me out, will ya? What have we got here? Thieves? Very stylish thieves. Bandits, they're all over the place lately. Looks like you can handle yourself in the fight. Does it? What's that supposed to mean? I'm a regular everyday trader. You often go around judging folks on how they look? Wow, sorry. Going after hip helpless traders now, are we? Clear out, little girl, says the bandit. Ha! And you don't even have the decency to deny it. Can't just watch a man's property get stolen, can I? Goes against my principles. Well, I've got like an axe. Am I a mountain climber? No, I'm a scavenger. Well, come on then, cowards. I'll take you for all you're worth. I shall defeat the bandits after moving this cushion up slightly. Uh, I have a jump button. It's A. I have an A button. It's jump. I have an X button. It's attack. And I also have a unique skill. She can traverse. She's got a dash. Uh, can't do it mid-air though. She slice, she dice, most importantly, she's twice as strong as the people attacking her. Ah, oh, retreat!
So two and a half D, eh? Not bad at all. Better than I expected from a young'un. Hogan's the name. Oh, like Paul Hogan from that film, Crocodile Dundee. I, I get what he did there. You really saved my skin. I owe you one. Never want to miss a trend. Hogan was quick to notice the sudden influx of adventurers to New Neve. 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 And even quicker to set up a shop in the town authorized. Towns. Authorised trading post. There we go. Those are the words together. CJ, honourable scavenger at your service. Honourable scavenger? How does that work? It's a weird mix between 3D, 2D. Uh, well, scavenger is just treasure hunting, isn't it? The only difference between that and thieving is whether your mark is living or dead. Thieves think too highly of themselves, though. That's what my clan says anyway. So scavenger suits you better, huh? You're journeying to New Neve uh, for treasure, then, I take it. Sure am. What about you? Just left, picked up some trinkets, and came out of here to sell them off. What about lenses? Do you have lenses? Yep, plenty of them, too. Heard, I even heard some lucky souls find rune lenses down them barrows. Yes! Yes! Uh, I just gotta get down there now. That humongous lens is as good as mine. Which way to the town? Now, what kind of gentleman would I be if I didn't take you there myself? Least I can do after all. I haven't decided on accents yet. Back again already, Ogun. Where, where's your escorts? Bolted at the first sign of bandits. Pay good money for them too. Bandits again. Tougher brand than the last time. Someone ought to do something. Look, we're just here to guard the checkpoint, alright? If you've got a complaint, take it up to the acting mayor. Yeah, yeah. Who's this little lady? Her name's CJ. She's a, uh, what was it? Uh, Honourable Scaringer. Here to accept the acting mayor's generous invitation. She's more than reliable than you. She's more reliable than you lay about, that's for sure. I'm a reckless adventurer, willing to whisk, whisk our lives, and a child at that. I take it as a compliment, thank you. There's not a single member of my clan who's got their head screwed on. Reckless fools, or every one of them. Fair enough. Acting male, certainly be glad to hear that. Proceed. I'm told there's a game here. Let me go down there. That man's a budgie? Yes. Back so soon? I'm quite sure I watched you leave just a little while ago. You won't be leave what happened, Squash. My word. Well, at least you are unscathed. Thanks to you, this young lady, no less. Madam CJ, was it? Squash, authorised appraiser. Pleasure to meet you. Connoisseur of all the shimmers, the promise of a glimmering future to squash to new Nieve to open up his accessory shop. Uh, his discerning eye quickly earned him the role of town's authorised appraiser. Also, he's a bird! Authorised appraiser? Indeed. It is my duty to appraise the efforts, to appraise the artifacts excavated from the barrows. What for? Why, to determine their value, of course. All artifacts found in the barrows are subject to an explorer tax of 30%. 30%? You haven't heard the worst of it yet. We want... If you want into the moon barrows, you're going to need an explorer's license from the acting mayor. And that license don't come cheap in that rice squash. I'm afraid so. The mayor sounds proper rapacious, if you ask me. Yep, rapacious is the word. Quite. Well, what's to stop me from sneaking out the other side of the ruin, anyway? Oh, I rec wouldn't recommend that. You get get caught trying to hightail out of here. 
a bag full of loot, well, you wouldn't get very far. May as I, I had an unsavoury from East Reach to put a stop to any thieving might occur. So I've heard at least. I've seen many a crook dealt with in my day, but that mercenary is unnerving. I'm quite sure his presence is the only thing keeping those bandits from darkening our door. Arr. Ow. How about we go see the mayor for ourselves, Eddie? Even a rapacious old soul can be reasoned with after all. Sounds like a plan. Lead the way. Right this way. The town is just ahead. Well then, perhaps the next time we meet you'll have handfuls of treasure for me to appraise. Until then, farewell. Ruined it. It was a perfectly good building and it's been ruined. Here it is. A flourishing new frontier in the rips of a gold rush. Welcome to New Nere. Not much to look at, is it? Well, <clears throat> I did say flourishing, didn't I? Work in progress, eh? Huh? Is this an earthquake? Ah, I can't stand earthquakes. You're fine, it wasn't even that big. Right, haha. <laughs> anyway, earthquakes are pretty common here, best be on your toes. Of course, it's thanks to an earthquake that we even found them barrows. Real big ones, about three months ago. So that's what happened. Well, I'll best be getting back. Got a store to run after all. Or will. Eventually. Figured I'd make a buck or two by setting up a trading post for adventurers to trade their wares. I keep changing his accent. It's it's, it's merging. <coughs> Sorry. Mosey on once I've opened up. Wait, where can I find the mayor you were talking about? Town office in the plaza, I suppose. Where else? Thanks, Hogan. Stay out of trouble now. Stop beeping. Fingers crossed, Missy. Fingers crossed. Bye-bye. Now then, it's time to track down this money-grabbing mayor. On the main menu, you can check the current quest progress as well. Your stats and items. Any map showing stuff? Yeah, I, I get it. There's the plaza, bustling, beating heart of this place. New to the townsfolk, and they, they do stuff with the things. There's a bulletin board. Cool, I have control. I have a jump button. I cannot attack in town, which is fair enough. Uh, quests. Treasure Hunter. Find the mayor. That makes sense. Stats and equipment. This is CJ. That's our stats. We can change our accessories. We have no accessories. Stow pack. I am not carrying anything. Storehouse. I'm not carrying anything. Achievements. I have done. That makes sense. Some controls, some graphics. We'll leave it as it is. Let's continue then. The map is kind of useful. Excuse me, any idea where a girl might find that rapacious acting mayor I've heard so much about? How rude! Oh, lighten up. I, I just... Wait, it's not you, is it? I am Isha, the acting mayor of this town. Yes! I should very much like to know who considers me rapacious, though. I haven't taken over the, as acting mayor after her father went missing. Isha is responsible for the decision to open up the quarry to adventurers and taxing them for the privilege. Ah, well, um... Uh, Hogan and Squash... Them again. Perhaps their taxes are due for an increase. Sorry, guys. So, rapacious might have been a bit much. Uh, 
from what I've heard about the mayor, I was expecting some old fogey. Not a charming young woman such as yourself. How old are you anyway? Sixteen, what of it? Same as me. I'm CJ, nice to meet ya. Another adventurer, I presume. Never judge a book by its boots, as they say. Oh, we welcome all sorts here. CJ, initials, perhaps. Prefer to keep your real name secret, is that it? Enough about me. License, that's right. I came here to get an explorer's license. An explorer's license cost 100,000 Bakua? Not a penny less. How come they have pennies but not a, a, a currency that I recognise? Are you mad, woman? Do I look like I've got that on me? I'm 16. Give me the children's fee. Like the horse carriages in the city. Do you think of me as dull-witted as that? Even your horse carriages consider anyone older than 12 capable of paying full price? Huh. You know your horse carriages. I'll give you that. Fret not. We offer assistance to the financially enfeebled. Take the stamp card. Collect enough stamps and I'll issue you an explorer's license. A stamp card? The residents of New Nieva post odd jobs on the bulletin board frequently. Complete a task and that resident will stamp your card for you. You know, one of the things I liked about Suikoden was that it was very pacey. It was, it was really well paced for an RPG. It was quite short, but it was really well paced. This, we'll see, but I've had one combat and it was a tutorial and we are 18 minutes in. Now, to be fair, I've played RPGs where it's been an hour, so we'll see. So I have to help out around the town, is that it? Uh, hang on, uh, something in the sky. There's a couple of examples. In a nutshell, yes. Many were troubled considerably by the earthquake three months back. Help is in great demand and short supply. Piece of cake. Don't go anywhere because I'll be back for my license before you know it. To be fair, I could have walked around anyway. Collect stamps and discard by helping the townsfolk with whatever they need. Essential for acquiring an explorer's license. No adventure in New Nieve. Whatever, how, however that's pronounced, can, can be without their stamp card. Yeah! We, 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 we did a thing. There's the bulletin board. Nothing much to see here. Not sure I understand the map. Hello, child. Hello. Don't suppose you know anyone who needs help around here? I sure do. Really? Who? Me. Oh. Look, I'd love to help you, but it's not going to get my card stamped. I'll have to decline. Stamp. Like the ones Maisha gave away. Gave everyone. Look, I got one. Wow, even you kids have them. This, with this stamp, adventurers will perform any and all tasks you require. They use and abuse them. That's what the Mayor Asia said. Rapacious might have been right on the money after all. Are you an adventurer too? Yep, call me CJ. What's your name? Freya. So will you help me, CJ? I certainly will. What can I do for you today, Priya? Find Yum Yum. Yum Yum ran away from home and hasn't come back yet. Can't be having that now, can we? Is Yum Yum your little sister, brother, cat? My cat, I knew she was a cat. She's white and fluffy and cute and cuddly. Yeah, it's just a cat. It's, uh... You want me to track down a cat? Is this a JRPG or something? So much for treasure hope hunting, I suppose. She got startled by the quake earlier and jumped out the window. She's st still little, so it's dangerous for her to go out by herself. She wanders the halls. She could be eaten by a monster. Oh, please help her find me. Yum Yum is my most treasured friend. Treasured, you say? Well, if there's one thing I'm good at, it's finding treasure. I'll have Yum Yum back to you in no time. Oh, thank you. I'll be right here, okay? Ugh. Oh, I find... Hmm, an outlander. Save your breath. 
This used to be a quiet little village till you showed up. Nothing but a nuisance, the lot of you. What is that Isha last thinking? No respect for tradition. Oh, never seen an adventurer like you before. If you find anything good, don't keep it always for yourself, yeah? <laughs> that old bag might not see the benefit of letting the adventurers in, but I do. Mining's all we got, especially now that they've sealed off the barrows. What use would a mining town be without a mine, honestly? Isha might be a bit daft sometimes, but she's right about this. What do you mean? Greedy, certainly, but daft. Oh, I didn't mean nothing by it. She's just different from the rest of us. Where's my cup of tea? Where's my cup? I've got to get my cup of tea. It, it was there. It was. It was. It was there. I didn't need to take my headphones off. Hmm. Oh, that's good. It tastes like tea. Tea flavored tea. How do I go those other directions? I want to find some stuff. Oh, fine. I'll talk to you. You haven't seen a fluffy white cat, cat being cute and cuddly around here, have you? I have Pierce cat, yeah. Yum yum. <gasps> really, where did it go? I pulled its tail and it ran off towards the woods. Why would you pull a cat's tail? Why not? Nothing to do with an outlander like you, anyway. Nothing to do. Charming. She's only small, so she gobbled up by monsters for sure. There are monsters all over the place since the mining started. There'll be no cats being gobbled on my watch. I promised Priya I'd return her treasure. That's what I'm going to do. Appreciate the info, kid. Could have done without the attitude, though. Right, I want to play some computer games, please. I can now go to the town outskirts. This place is... Can't go to the Great Forest yet. We shall go to the Great Forest because that's our first day on the job quest. A large, lush forest located just outside the border of New Nieve. While the area is rich with food, wood, and stone, all those words have the letter O in. The monsters, which also has a letter O in, which have gathered there since the earthquake, have made it a dangerous place to be. What's this? Why do they glow so? Cat, no idea, sorry. Computer games. And a laptop. I'm stronger now. Find a cat. A cat. Small, white, fluffy, cute. Yep, must be yum yum. Ahem. Yum yum. Piss, 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 piss. It was a good kitty, eh? Ouch. Nothing to be afraid of. Please don't run away. It's not how you pick up a cat. Don't pick up cats like that. Gotcha. Ow. What a little angel like you doing in a place like this. Let's get you back to your family, shall we? Hold the cat properly. Just support it. I'm back and look who I found. Meow. Yum yum. The cat makes purring noises. I was so worried about you, dummy. Cut her some slack, yeah? She had a bit of a scare and ran off into the woods, that's all. A scare? Oh no, I'm sorry, yum yum. At least you're not hurt. Don't go wandering off no more, okay? Wow. Thank you so much, CJ. As promised, here's my stamp. Why, thank you. Yeah, just get them all off the kids. It's gotta be the easiest jobs, right? On some town. <sighs> Plenty more to go. Say, Priya, you don't know what else happened. 
know anyone else who might need some help, do you? Sure do. Really, who's next then? My dad! Our house got messed up in the big quake three months ago. Dad's been trying to fix it, but he never has enough wood. Do you think you could help him, CJ? Of course, I leave it to me. Got to fill the stamp card so I can get my explorer's license, you see. Can't expect it to stamp itself, can I? You're the best, CJ. So, where's your dad? We live just over there in the residential district. <gasps> I never considered turning right. Got it. Bye for now, Priya. Bye bye. I have a stamp and some experience. Uh, do you still have to level up? Oh, an achievement. Main quest two. <laughs> Play me game. You can now go. Yeah, I, I got that. I figured it out. Nothing much is here. Lifelong residents of New Nearby have their homes in this part of the town. Acting Mayor Isha also calls this place home. Hmm. Excuse me. Don't suppose you're your priest, Dad, are you? Well, who might you be? Never adventurer looking for treasure. Yep, I'm CJ. Nice to meet you. I'm Ganesh. You're not Ganesh. How exactly do you know my Priya then? I just realised Priya is... Yeah. Uh, we just met in the plaza. I helped track her down. Tra track down Yum Yum. Is that so? Very kind of you. What brings you here to me? Priya said you've been having some trouble rebuilding your home after that big quake. Thought I'd come to lend a hand. I see. Suppose you're collecting stamps then. Yep, I've only got one for now. So if there's anything you need help with, I'm your girl. Suppose I do have a too small job that you could take care of. Do? Why not? agrimaire has got the right idea as far as you adventurers go. You're willing to work? Then who am I to turn you away? Right. Um, <laughs> what's the job? I need you to gather some wood for the repairs of my house. You'll have to venture outside the Great Forest outside of town. To the Great Forest. That's all. No problem. I go myself, but since the excavation of all sorts... I've heard all sorts of creatures. I have been seen in the woods. Everyone here is far too scared to venture down and see for themselves. I had no idea Rune Barrows had caused so much trouble. Oh, you'll be needing an axe then, unless you plan on taking the trees and talking the trees into coming down here. Take this odd one. Thanks, I'll be back in a bit. Take care. I've got an axe. I can cut down trees. I've got a potion. I can heal. Same again. Uh, you get stuff with dead things. I can keep them. I got a bag. Those monsters haven't returned. Jump attack. Well, 
remember them. Just the one lumber, actually. Did I four? Oh, four three. I did not realize. Hmm. I'm back. Got what you need, I reckon. I think that's a whistle. Wonderful. Finally, I can finish. Fixing my house. You have my thanks. This house has been my family for generations. It's my most treasured possession. Don't know what I'd do if I were to lose it. I'm sensing a theme here. My ancestors are probably rolling in their graves. You really helped me out, you know? Here's a stamp card. Thanks, CJ. You're very welcome, Priya. Yummy Yum is behaving herself, I trust. Yow. You're good and you are. You know, if all adventurers are like you, then my old man might come around. You got anywhere to stay while you're here? Nah, not yet. I guess I should look for the inn. You won't find anything like an inn around here, I'm afraid. What? But then, where do all the adventurers stay? You pitch tents down by Outlander Lane. Tents? Of course, I doubt there'd be any space for another one down there now. Adventurers have been pouring in for the last few months, all looking to strike it rich. Just sleeping on the streets, didn't expect that. Well, it looks nice. I mean, no earthquakes, but apart from that. It's all the same to you. We have a little house you could borrow. <gasps> How have you got a spare house? Last tenant just let... Okay. Nothing fancy. It looks bigger than your main house. Beat sleeping rough, I'd wager. Oh, well, I don't really have any money. You saw to it that Priya and me had a roof over our heads. The least I can do is offer the same kind. Well, you had a spare house. So the wood wasn't that important. No need for the money. Really? Here's the key. Just down the hill. Take a look if you have the time. Thank you. I don't need to do an adventure. I've got a house now. Yeah, I'm not a super big fan of the pacing so far. It's like... You don't you don't get to do anything without being immediately interrupted by a cutscene. How's the lodgings then? Think I'll do. Of course, but is it really okay for me to stay here for free? I said as much, didn't I? Man's only as good as his word. Well, if you don't mind though, I'd appreciate if you'd help father like you'd helped us. Your father? Sapir's grandfather? Have I established how all three of you are related yet? I'm happy to help. But with what? Repairing the clock tower. Clock Tower? I've only played Clock Tower 3, I'm afraid. Uh, you might have noticed a fallen pillar of rubble in the plaza. I did not notice that, no. Uh, that used to be our town's symbolic Clock Tower. An actual, literal Clock Tower as well. It's both. Uh, I tried telling my father that we just don't have the materials to fix it, but do you think he'd listen? No? No, he wouldn't. Say no more. You need help. I need stamps. That's all there is to it. Also, uh, word to the wise, my father can be a bit blunt. Uh, to put it lightly. I don't doubt he'll put his foot in his mouth at some stage, but I appreciate it. You just ignore him. No worries. I'm well used to dealing with old folks. Thank you. His name's Shiva. Yes, I, I again, I, 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 I saw the pattern uh, when I realised Ganesh and Priya. Uh, yeah. Uh, uh, yes. So, hang on. It's Shiva the Destroyer. Uh... I can't. I, I know Ganesh. Um, shopkeepers use Ganesh. I don't. I don't know all the um, all the gods. Uh, if you head to the plaza now, you'll probably find him. Hindu gods. I was gonna say. Uh, CG CJ is home away from home. Base for for adventuring. Resting here for the night will recover all your strength. This is absurd. You've just got given away a shack. Uh, 
stay here. Don't need to be an adventure anymore. Help out at times, yeah, but you can save your progress at CJ's base without any signpost. If you're defeated in battle, you'll resume the game from your last save. What a save will automatically do some. Yep, we did, we did the quest. Respect, we did, dude, we got him some wood. Wow, well, we've got another quest. Uh, wait, wait. I, I can't. Some aggressive xylophone playing. Oh, yeah. Yeah. As if we haven't had a bad bad enough already. Excuse me, are you please grandpa by any chance? Hmm. And if I am, what's it to a mon money hungry outlander? Hmm. I heard you could use a hand restoring the clock tower to its former glory. Me? A hand? Oh, I see. You think you can line your pockets by taking advantage of an elderly gentleman, is it? that it? Well, you won't pull the wool over my eyes away with you. Oh, no. No. Um, so it's, I, I'm imagining she's saying that like in, you know, The Happening. Mark Wahlberg, when the woman's like, you're trying to kill me. No. No, no, no. That's not it at all. Please, Dad asked me to help you out. A useless old sod. Been flapping his gums to Outlanders now, is he? Stay out of this, Outlander. No one needs help from the likes of you. But this is important, isn't it? Of course it is. My ancestors built this when they first arrived at Old Nieve 150 years ago. A more precious treasure this town has never known. Of course it's bloody important. Old Nieve? I thought this place was called New Nieve. CJ? C C CJ, you understand why? Oh, why the old Nieve is the town our ancestors came upon. Abandoned it was, barely worth being called a town, or so the story goes. They built up a new, called it New Nieve. This clock tower is a treasured testament to their vision for New Nieve. Pains me to see it in this state. Can't have that then, can we? Lucky for you, I know a thing about taking care of judges. You can keep your coin, good sir. A stamp will do just fine. A stamp? Huh. Those things Daxka da da Daxa's girl sent around? It's basically work. Better a no good venture take it on than any of us. Fine, get to it. You'll need to get the great tree bough from the biggest tree in the great forest. Off you go then. I'd fucking love to go off. Uh, how am I supposed to know which is the biggest one? Give me a hint or something. Well, it'll be the one furthest in, won't it? It's huge. You couldn't miss it. Why would it be the one furthest in? That's not logs. Furthest in, huh? Okay, I'll be back. And it's just the one furthest in. That's how big trees work. You'll have three saves and no more. You'll have four saves and no more. I'm just happy I get to hit stuff. Go 
Got a gargoyles win. Also, these are gargoyles. I did get did get hurt a little. Leveled up as well. No mushroom. This is very exciting menu music. And I think it's because I happen to hit this part of the screen. Post. Titan Nectar, let's go down. It is. You a kangaroo? Look at looking at something. You want adventure too? Here for the treasure? Sure, why not? What's that then? Looks important. Ash, just rock. Doesn't look like an ordinary rock though. Wait, you haven't seen a big, huge tree in your travels, have you? Nah. It's further in then, thanks anyway. Hold it, princess. Huh? What? The forest's crawling with monsters nowadays. If you go any deeper, you might not come back out. Monsters? Gulp? What kind of scavenger would I be if I let that put me off? I want to heal though. That's nuts. So much lumber and a wild bird egg. Treasure. Nuts as well. Yep, this must be the one, all right. Hmm, which branch looks best, huh? What the? Second evil tree I spoke to today. Menacing boss lies uh, deep inside each dungeon. Once they've been discovered, defeating them is the only means of escape. Watch closely and attack when the attacks enemies reveal their weak point to deal major damage. Some stronger enemies, such as bosses, are protected by a shield. Wait until you've broken through the shield, the enemy will take no damage. Pay close attention to the shield as well. 
Your step pack carries healing potions. Oh, I didn't think it'd be quite so little. the chromatic aberration uh, the great tree bow has been received a valuable material necessary for development of rune lenses some oh a rune fragment yes some resources can serve as catalysts to create a variety of runes when combined with this material some items are more valuable than others when you find a valuable item um, uh, on your travels you won't be able to throw it away but it won't take up space in your resource bag How do I get to that? Hmm. It's not finished yet. Guess I need to go back to the signpost. This one, yes. Probably could have walked there. I'm back. Let me see, let me see. Yes, yes, this will do. No doubt about it. Great tree bow. Could have warned me, you know, because about the big scoring monster tree that attacks me as soon as I saw it. Excuse me? The tree fiend. Would have been nice to know in advance, that's all. I'm lucky it didn't pick branches off me. Tree fiend? Impossible. The sorcerer. I want them. I want, want all of them. Are you alright, all right, my old man? Got a moment, not interrupting something, are we? Shiva, could we... Could you spare a few minute, minutes? The rapacious, I mean, rather brilliant acting mayor. What was that? Nothing, nothing at all. Excuse me. Shiva, this is Gokto uh, of Outlander Lane. I believe you've already met, but allow me to formally introduce you all the same. The smell of gold and promise of fortune drew this sag sagacious Gokto to New Nieve, where he quickly became the rep representative for the merchants and adventurers of Outlander Lane. That's an quite the jacket he's got. got the jacket scarf combo I see what brings you both here I've got nothing to say to either of you Shiva I know you and I don't you and I don't see eye to eye on the barrows still I I expect you to abide by my decisions as such I must ask you and the other objectors to stop causing trouble in outlander lane the stamp card system is going along towards building trust between us and the outlanders Trust? You don't know the meaning of the word. If you'd an ounce of sense in your head, you'd chase every last venture out before it's too late. Let's all try to stay calm, shall we? What exactly are you talking about? Too late for what? The evil sorcerer's curse. He's in the barrows, I tell you. He who suffered the wrath of the gods themselves. He was sealed for a reason. Mark my words. Break that seal and it won't be just fiends you'll be up against. It'll be much, much worse than that. Now this sounds like an adventure. You can't put so much stock in...
Old Fable Shiva. Hmm. So I, I, um... That... I, I've started to figure out what's breaking on my PC. Luckily it didn't... Oh no, no, it did. It, it crashed the game. Uh, that's fine. That's fine. Uh, it, I don't have a button to press right now. Uh, so I'm going to close the program. Uh, it's much worse on other games because I can actually lose progress. Let's just immediately load it back up. Um, I'm going to have to have a look at the event viewer as well. Um, I'll do that. Uh, 9.32. I'll do that afterwards. Yes, that's unfortunate. Um, something to do with my graphics card. Crashing games, it's really frustrating. But it doesn't do it for like all games. It does it do a lot of stuff on the Game Pass? I don't know why. Oh, the auto is rubbish. Skip it, unfortunately. But we can try to get where I was. Like, you can skip the entire conversation, that's fine. Let's all try to stay calm. Sorry, trust. You don't need to know the meaning of the word. Let's all try to stay calm. What exactly are you talking about? Too late for what? The evil sons of curse. Isn't about okay? No, no, we did see this. Sounds like an adventure. Can't put too much stock on the old man's fables. Fables, eh? I suppose that expedition that went in were fabled to death, were they? You want our children to go through that too? This town is on the verge of collapse. Mining is beneficial for our people and essential to new Nierve's continued existence. Exactly. And what of your precious clock tower? Surely you could use some strapping young adventurers to help rebuild it. Isn't that right, young lady? Uh, me too. Uh, well, sure, that was the plan. See, honestly, Shiv, you embarrass yourself. I've got countless young folk who tell me every day how they're hard they slave away for the, this town for the good of this town and its residents. How long do you intend to hold out? Think of the effect it will have on your family's reputation. Ah, fine, please yourself. Pay no mind to stop an old man like me. Wait, my stamp. Oh, give me the card. Right, I'm gonna th I think I'm gonna use that opportunity to let you go. Uh, um, I wasn't planning on only playing for an hour, uh, but I'm apparently just really tired right now. I like the stamps at uh, random angles. So let's save and let you go. We've had a quick little look at this game. So it also serves at the start of chapters. Okay, yeah. 45 minutes essentially. I know it's been like 10 minutes more. Oh, uh, I'll be back soon. I'm just going to take a nap, I think. Because, uh, yeah, I'm struggling. Hello, Screams, and farewell. 
Uh, yeah, I don't really have the energy right now. I'm not really sure why. Uh, but yeah. Also, I guess I should investigate the crash. Anyway, thank you for watching. I don't have the uh, uh, background picture I'd want yet. I'll track that down. Uh, yeah, I'll give this game more of a play. It's uh, 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 from the um, Game Pass. Uh, let me do the, the thank you. I should probably finish Tunic, or at least try to finish Tunic. If it doesn't crash. Anyway, farewell. Goodbye.